Hi, I'm back. Uh, just want to let you know I'm starting to run some of the bus wires. This is the uh, number 12 wire that I get uh, from Home Depot. Um, I buy it, this time I bought it in the big 500 foot long round. So I probably need about 300, but it ends up being cheaper to buy it in the, in the bulk uh, way. Uh, and uh, that way I don't run out of it and I don't have to spend three times as much money buying it. Um, but anyway, that's uh, the wire I use, and I use this contraption to go ahead, and this is how I twist the wire like this, and then I use uh, different colors of tape to designate uh, the different buses. Um, you can see under here, this, this is the new, uh, bus number four or district number four and this one has white tape on it so i've got it annotated and back up a little bit that this is a green and red wire and it's twisted because that's what's required for my nce system with a piece of white tape about every uh, four or five feet i put that white tape and that way it holds it in place anyway so you can see here's another section of the white tape. Now what it's doing is bus four or district four, I use bus because it's I'm talking about the wire, is actually running all the way around in the middle. I bring it over into here and it goes all the way down the end of the peninsula down there and then back around the other side under here and you can see the other white wire there and then it goes over there over to the power section which i'll show you here in a minute where it goes down over there so i did the bus four today plus i also ran bus three and here's the end of uh, bus three or district three right here it's got it's green and red wire with a with a blue tape on it and it's just tied off here for the time being of course it's twisted again and it's going in as you can see the outside holes i have uh, four sets of holes two on each side so the bus four is in the in the middle bus three is on the outside or district three and district four and they wrap around the peninsula I'll be back in a minute. I'll show you some of the wires uh, that I, or excuse me, tape that I use to wrap on the wire. The yellow, the white, the blue. I have a couple other colors. Here's some of my other wire, number 18s that I use. I always use lots of wire. Now here, you can see here is the blue wire, which is bus three or district three, the, the power for that, number 12. And it's coming around the outside of the peninsula and goes down underneath. And then in here, you can see in the center is the, the red and green wire with the white tape. And it's for this section up in here in the peninsula. The bus three or district three is around the outside of the peninsula. And district four or bus four is in the, uh, the center. And you can see it running along the middle and I got tape on it every, like I said, every, about every uh, four or five feet. And I hear they're coming together. Here's the white one here. This is a blue one. I probably, yeah, there's the blue right there. I'll put another one here so that I can identify it readily. It's coming under here. They're wrapping around. It's not supposed to be over the top of that. For Those are temporary, these clamps. And what I'm doing is I'll show you underneath. It comes in. And then they go down. There's my speedometer I'll be using later on when I do speed matching. Go down in the hole. And here the wires are coming down underneath. And then they go into the circuit breakers for bus three, uh, bus, bus four on the end there. Bus three, bus four. So that's uh, kind of what I've been doing.